I think of a personal memory, it's, it, it would be up in uh, his constituency where he used to come and stay with us and we just had a lot of laughs and I can remember looking, we used to look out on Ben Nevis and I, I don't know why I find this so funny but he'd say, do you know I've never been up there? And I used to think, how could you live right next to Ben Nevis your whole life and you've never actually been up there? But Charles was not as fanatical about exercise as I am. Uh, but I, I just, the memories kind of, mink, you know, they mix in with all sorts of different things. I'll tell you one thing I would say about Charles. I, I always, because lots and lots and lots of politicians have been in our house and been in our lives and my children have seen a lot of them and, and they can see right through politicians. And they saw in Charles somebody who was obviously clever, obviously principled, obviously a giving person and obviously, you know, with a flaw or two, like we all do. Uh, but I, I just, I just remember him as a very warm, very committed, engaging, funny guy, but who was complicated. Charles was a complicated guy, and you know we shouldn't pretend otherwise.